Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is a Tuesday night and I'm still on the road, but I have stopped long enough to listen to Big Booty Mix 17 and drink some wine. So I want to drink wine and uh, eat some cheese and pull some cards and tell some stories. Uh, so let's see what's going on. Let's just see what comes to mind. Um, yeah, so Big Booty 17 is playing. 17 is my favorite number. Um, it's got Fruit Loops and a parrot on it. Parrots have kind of been a theme. Ooh, parrots are all about being vibrant. And the King of Cups, we have the Page of Cups, Cups and the King of Cups. Someone is going from thinking to knowing or pondering to knowing or a nudge to affirmation. Ooh, just tell me about this page. What was this page doing? Pages are immature. Messages. They weren't investing. They were kind of holding back. They were watching. They were spying. Watching, waiting. Not taking action. They were carrying a lot. That's the thing is that a king has mastered his emotions. He doesn't let things bother him. He doesn't let his emotions impact his day. A page has a lot of um, like little bubbles, little, I just imagine like a volcano getting like, like it's not quite hot enough to explode, but the, the pressure builds. I don't know, like a teenager in puberty. They're, they're touchy, sensitive. I mean, look at those stupid little pants. I'm sorry, they're stupid pants. So, Ooh, we got a couple. Title card, his stupid pants. He's like, I'm sick of wearing these stupid pants. I want bigger, I want better. He's been watching everybody else. He's learning. Or all about himself, herself. This, this could be gender's fluid. I'm gonna say him or her, depending on the story as, as it comes as an example, I don't know, whatever. We'll figure it out. I feel like they're figure, they're like, picking themselves apart and deciding what they want to keep to move forward. Cause this, this Empress is like, maybe they found somebody who's inspired them. Somebody who, um, cause the title card, this card particularly to me is like, it's like the Empress on the wall. It's like, she's framed on the wall. Like that maybe it's a vision board. Maybe you're doing vision boards or something. Maybe it's, um, like you just put a poster on a wall. An idol. Billy Idol. All right. Ooh, taking action, but it wanted to spin. You see, I don't take my cards in reverse with healing on the bottom. Maybe this person has been healing or they have healed or they weren't taking action because they were healing. I mean, with any surgery, you, you pull yourself apart. You have a recovery time. And the title card, that's what they were doing. They were pulling themselves apart. So after you shed what isn't for you, you kind of got to like recalibrate and figure out like, oh, I can, I can walk forward now. It's way easier. I don't have all that shit hanging on me. Now it's like literally dropping baggage and then it's like resetting your shoulder blades and you're like, oh, my posture. You know, it's like that. Good for them. Now they can move freely. Now you can take action. I just heard land ho. Are you a pirate? All right, let's use a different deck. Any, any other deck. Let me put that away. Any other deck. Any other one. Okay. I thought I had the tower on both of them. Big booty is so good. It really is. It's so fucking good. All right. High Priestess on the bottom. The Ace of Pentacles. A lot of these cards want to come out in reverse. I don't take reversals, but a lot of them want to. The High Priestess. So hypothetically, we're going to take it in reverse. You know 
that you missed an opportunity or you know that an opportunity is being withheld from you. Or you didn't take an opportunity because you didn't know enough about it. But that kind of goes back to you missing it. Or you didn't take an opportunity because you were already emotionally committed to another one. Hi Priestess again. Battle scars. These battle scars. You're fighting yourself. Ooh, needs versus want. Head versus heart. Ooh. The devil you know is better than the devil you don't. You went back to what was safe. But it wasn't safe at all. It fucked your day right up. <sighs> right up. Remember all that healing you did? Boot that. Yeah, the devil. The devil on the page of swords. I think you just redefined what evil was. You redefined. You've seen evil now. You've seen when someone's a bad person, when someone has a bad heart, you've seen it. Now you know what it means. When someone talks about somebody with a bad heart, you're like, you don't need to go any further. Nope. I know exactly what you mean. Ooh. Because you've seen true support. You've seen true structure, true patience. You've seen somebody... The patience of a fucking saint with no good reason who believed in you even though you didn't give them reason to. They believed in you even though you didn't give them reason to. Even though you left them like this. But love is in their structure. Love is their being. And they, they were not made that way either. They had to learn to be that way. And you thought that you couldn't be with this person because you could never be that way. You're, you're, you said, I'm not that way. Guess what? You are. This evil person just taught you that you are. Because you, any other person, if you had a bad heart, if you still thought you were evil, whatever this person did, anybody else would wish, would wish them dead. And you're going above it. Look, you're like, oh, fuck, I'm getting swamped. It's getting swampy. Oh, whoa. I'm going to go right over that shit. See, that's the king of wands. Or the, not the king of wands. Wow. That's the king of cups. He's mastered the emotions because water is all about emotions. Like, so these ones, like, oh, 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 I'm starting to swim. Oh, starting to swim. We're going to get right out of that shit. We got to learn to traverse that one. And you did. Page of Wands in this deck specifically is a genius. Outmaneuvered. I just heard outmaneuvered. But the way Eddie Izzard says it, outmaneuvered. A lesser being. Or someone you think of a lesser being now. Yeah, this person's not kind. All right. Well. I just got a nudge to use my um, Nightmare Before Christmas deck. Expand on that. Okay, fine. Fine, I will. This is a new one. I actually uh, planned on getting this. This is my gift to me for being here. I've decided that whenever I go to new cities, I'm either going to get myself a sticker and or a tarot deck. And then I always write where I get it on the bottom and uh, try to keep them together and nice as best I can. But... Back to that Stephanie proof thing, it's not. Wow. Alright, anyway. Ten of Cups. I don't even know if you can hear me. Two and three needles. Page needles. 
Four of Cups, King of Pentacles, and the Five of Cups, the Six of Cups on the bottom. Five of Wands, excuse me. I feel like someone finally took their emotions out of a situation and they're looking at just the hard facts. And they're realizing like, even if this person had a full cup to pour for, excuse me, a full cup to pour from, they still wouldn't want any of it. That what they long for is all in the past. But they've removed their emotions from the situation and all that's left is fighting. There's no love. It's black and white. This person has nothing black and white to hold on to and, and feel good about. Even the memories are gray and dull. Sorry, you just made the wrong choice. And you know it. And you're hurting. Why are you hurting? You don't have to hurt. Make another choice. A different choice. It's not easy. You just have to choose it. The chariot and strength with the knight of candles on the bottom. The Knight of Wands, action taker. Hmm. The chariot, going places, doing things, and strength, persisting, regardless. You're in an empty, loveless situation. You can't give any more. You've invested all you can. This person just is not what you're looking for. Any other, any other messages? You're somebody else's wish, but if you give in to their wish fulfillment, you are cutting yourself so short. Like somebody else may be like, you're everything I've wanted. You're, you're perfect for me, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, that may be true, but you're not perfect for me. And you're supposed to grow. Relationships are built. You're supposed to build on each other. But this person's like a succubus. You may, they may, whoever may be, the best thing that ever happened to this person. I feel like they're from like a comfortable family. I feel like they're from like, I don't know, affluence. But this person It's not the sharpest tool in the shed. Not very good work ethic. Toast for the jerk offs, ones that never take work off. Run away as fast as you can. Yeah, I would do that if I were you. Go discover a whole new world. All right, I think that's all I got. Really, I just wanna Put cheese in my mouth. Cheese and crackers. Breakfast of champions. Victory after the towel. Aw. You gotta let it fall. I'm not the man they think I am at home. I'm a rocket man. Burning out his fuse up there alone. It's all right. Come on, you got a light. You got a loyal friend to lead you around. I don't know if that'll help, but you don't have to work with this person. You the king and queen. Yeah, with the devil right underneath. You know that this person brings out the worst in you. you you're better alone. You had some time on, you're, you're better alone. This person is not good for you. They're not good for you. I heard overdose. Just don't, just don't be around them. Please just don't be around them. I know maybe you're scared they're gonna hurt themselves if you're not around.
You guys have different ideas of fun. You enjoy to work. You enjoy working. This person may be a bit of a lush, a bit of a shut in, be hanging out with people that are kind of draining. And maybe you hang around them because you want to be a good influence. But you know what you look like? It's just fucking the one good thing hanging around all these lost souls. So keep walking into the dark. Don't worry. There's a light. Don't let your light go out I'm trying to keep everybody else's light. It's not your job to put up with everything. No. I don't know. Alright, I think that's it. Two of swords again. 153 on the clock. King of Pentacles keeps wanting to come out. The magician, the high priestess. trip to what you want. You have black and white proof. This isn't a gamble anymore. You have black and white proof. Seven, eight, and nine of wands on here. Actions. Actions are about to turn into tangible products. You're going to be at manifestation. You're gonna have something really good coming in soon. Or maybe you're going to it. But whatever it is, it's going to cherish you. Black and white, in black and white, it's gonna be clear, very clear, that you're this person's everything. I hope it's soon. All right, I think that's all I got.